Hey YouTube, what is going on over on the More Swag channel? So every every few months, videos of like this pop up, you know, people, the, the views aren't working for them. They got to find some to give views. There's this new video this person made where he talks about me cheating and lying in Warzone. It's, it's legit funny at this point. And what's even more funnier is the people in the comments that genuinely believe are like brainwashed to actually believe people like this. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. If you guys are brand new, make sure you guys drop a like and hit that subscribe button down below. I can't wait to see what they got to say. So let's check it out. Tweet saying that that I should be kicked from FaZe Clan for aimbotting and different things like that. I'm gonna just tell you right now, I don't blame you guys for thinking I'm hacking or I have aimbot. The shots I was hitting were nuts, man. Here we go again. So, here is a little bit of regular gameplay from Swag while playing on his PC. Oh, oh no, he's not, he's across from us. Hit him a little bit. Yeah, I'm I'm on. Rotating in the open. Yep. C58 was nice. I dropped the 30 ball this game. Now, here is Swag playing on a console with no cheats installed. Doing. Die bar. <laughs> you know what's really just comical is that he showed that clip is if you're gonna do that i played on console for the first eight months of warzone eight months of warzone when it first came out when i was popping i won a hundred thousand dollar tournament the biggest tournament with the most viewers and i was the only one in the tournament on console so like this whole argument and i'm on xbox first of all i don't use an xbox controller if you're a PlayStation player and you go to an Xbox controller, it is so awkward. My hands do not fit on that thing. I use a scuff impact. I use an impact. So as far as that, it's just all a comfortability. Now it's on Xbox. Like, look, look what I'm playing on. Like, genuinely look. Show when I dropped a 40 multiple times on console when the game first came out, right? Show when I won a $100,000 tournament. Show those moments, you know what I'm saying? Bro, look what I'm playing. Look at this spray and pray shooting. Oh, I don't know how I won that gunfight. <laughs> Uh, no, I pulled my sh <laughs> You know what's funny is like of like yes, I have bad mo I have troll moments. Go to my stream. I literally just I don't care like I just mess around. Probably gonna die because there's a bot. Oh god. Oh god. I'm so dead. Genuinely no aim assist. I'm so dead. Oh dude, I'm so dead. Bro, I I, I can't aim that far. No oh, bro. Xbox is just bad and Xbox controller is just bad as well. Notice the difference? How can you go from FaZe Pro to an absolute bot just by playing Call of Duty on a console? Are you kidding me? You know what, let me, let me actually do this. Here, I'll go to this right now. Yeah, I'll show you right now. This gameplay right here is from when? September 7th, 2020. This is literally seven months into Warzone. Whatever the fact, 40 kills. And guess what I'm playing on? Console. Using the same control I always use as Scuff Impact. 34 kills. Hey, he's top, he's top blue looking at us right now. Top blue, top blue. Yeah. This is a, a four, 40 on. bomb. Yeah, you can take when I was, I look like a bot, bro. What? And Booyah sounds so young. Look at this, bro. Oh my God. Up top, up top, up top. Jump down on you. 40, 40. On console. Wait. 40 That was my first 40 too. This whole argument is just stupid. It's just dumb. This was just dumb. Just make up, they just make up something. A radar hack. I've never even heard of a radar hack. Really? Let me remind you. Here is a clip from a recent video we did regarding a radar hack that Swag is well aware of and still unaddressed. Radar hack. He runs toward the door, opens it so the enemy's back will be at the rear window. Runs around to the window and shoots him in the back. What a play! Player. He knew exactly the location and direction of the- What an actual play. And I guarantee if you play back that clip, I- uh, saw the guy go in there or i he was on uav before when i popped it like i said just take it out of context this is just like and people oh, bro people believe this shit they believe it bro. player why did he choose that house let's find out he has an active uav but his enemy is running ghost and should be hidden however his esp radar hack still shows his enemy is there Faze Swag assumed he didn't have Ghost, big mistake. Streamers and some professional gamers Completely often buy lots him. of UAVs to mask the use of ESP cheats. This time, he was caught out. Shame on you. Can you remember when we released this video? He runs toward the door, opens it so the enemy's back will be at the I rear window. Yeah, completely outplaying Runs him. around to the window and shoots him in the back. Pro player. Of course, he takes his clip completely out of context. I most likely saw him go in there 100%, but he plays the first three seconds of this clip and people eat it up. The haters love it. They love They love it. They love this. Oh my God, his they ESP love it. His ESP radar hack still shows his enemy is there. Streamers buy ESP, buy a bunch of UAVs to hide the ESP. Shame on you. 
It caused FaZe Apex to private message swag with a warning to stop cheating, or you will be kicked like Jarvis. Look, man, I can't even believe my boy Apex even DM me asking about, you know, some of these videos out there. Bro, we, me and Apex, we, tro this is a troll. This is legit. This is <laughs> Oh my God, bro. They think Apex is actually serious. People keep saying I'm cheating, yada, yada, yada. There's been a lot of tweets saying that I should be kicked from FaZe Clan for aimbotting and different things like that. This really hit a nerve with Swag. I even, tell, I even had to tell Apex, like, yo, yo, chill, 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 chill. I don't want to be hacking like that. Is this evidence of Swag using walls? Watch how he moves directly to the enemy. But how can he even no, see him? Want. Look at the tracking, it's hilarious. Are we supposed to take these Warzone players seriously? This is disgusting. You can, How can you track someone you can't even see? He's you on dirty the zip. little rat. Let's try and see if we can see the enemy. The thing is, with, with like that clip, it's like if you play Warzone, you've shot people in the gas. This is so dumb. Like as far as the zip, like you can literally get aim assist on a guy as he's going up the zip. Like you're a bot. Like you're a legit bot. If you've never played Warzone and you don't understand like just like simple shit like this, like this is, I have a Type 100. Let's try a deep color burn. This will surely locate him. No, not a chance. Deep color burn. This is because he should not be able to see him. It's interesting how Swag arrives right before the enemy starts to travel up the rope, so he can't shoot back. But this is the wall master himself, king of the rats. Of course he can see him, he can see everyone. Here is Swag currently on 36 kills in a bot lobby. Burner game, burner game. Ah, the heartbeat sensor. Cheating streamers love them. Watch how he checks it and then gets a ping. But a ping is not enough. Now he will cast his eyes to a second monitor to reveal the exact location. But there is a problem. Bro, th this one's always so funny because people act like you don't look up at your minimap. Like you don't have a minimap that you pay attention to. I pay attention to my minimap probably more than my actual like game in front of me. Bro, this is just... Like I said, this has been... People do this... Every couple months, they always come out with videos like this. And the fact there's over a thousand comments. I gotta read the comments after this. That heartbeat ping was for the enemy in the window, not the enemy behind the bus. Swag should not be able to track him as he is running ghost. Jesus Christ, that's Jason Bourne. Just as we suspected, there he is. I don't understand. I definitely heard that guy getting shot at because he was legit one bullet. So obviously the clip he's taken out of context, I'm hearing that guy get shot at. A lot of it is audio cues. It's like genuine fans and they've seen videos that i use a cronus or a vpn and they say they're no longer fans of me you mean these bot lobbies if you want to keep your fan base get your rodent ass out those bot lobbies and into a so what he did so what he did is he took games from one two three four different days he took the lowest kd from the four different days that we played and just put it all together four four different days and he lined it up like this yeah, those are probably some of my best games for surely. One game, but like just come to my stream. Just come watch my stream for seven hours. The community is tired of hearing about streamers crying on about skill-based matchmaking. If you're not good enough to play against other players with the same I skill don't cry level, about it. maybe I, you shouldn't have I boosted play, your play. stats in the first place. These streamers love to enter lobbies where casual gamers and children play. They do this to satisfy I their the kids. Ego and gas each other up about how fantastic they are. Someone said, okay, I legit thought Swag was legit, but when I saw the clip of him perfectly tracking the person go up the balloon in the gas, I was totally convinced he's some type of cheating software. That is sad, man. There's just like genuine people out there who are so like, so gullible and just like eat this shit up, like eat it up, bro. Like I said, if, if you think I'm cheating, man, just c come to one of my streams, man. Um, I'll be streaming today. So just c come hang out for like six, seven hours and then kind of make your synopsis there, bro. Like for real, like, I mean, anybody can take a six minute video, a certain clip out of context and kind of twist it the way they want. But I've been playing Warzone for three years, man. You know what I'm saying? I still have over 10,000 people who watch me daily. People who still watch my videos and stuff like that. So yeah, he got his little views. There's over a thousand comments. I'm sure all the haters are loving this. So no, if you have haters, I mean, I think you're doing something right, man. So let me know what your thoughts in the comments are, man. If you if you believe this guy, I'm not going to sit here. It's, it's been three years in Warzone. I'm not going to sit here and try to convince you. It's just, you, know, you can do whatever you want, but I'm going to still do me, so.